hashtag the stand at Ram Aguko at KY254 channel. The hashtag as always is the stand. Start right now. Give us your take even as we continue with this conversation right here on Y254. Gentlemen, you've given us your take in regards to this. And uh, I would like to start with a quote by Honorable Raphael Tuju, the, OD, the, 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 the Secretary General of Jubilee Party. And he said this, and I quote, political parties are about politics and how to be in control. It is an aggressive sport because it is always about how to elbow each other out for positions. It would be strange if politicians sat somewhere and agreed on everything peacefully. Now, I picked up two things. One, we're talking about control. And I would like to pose this to you, Karl Marx. Uh, maybe we can assume that wrangles are there and that wrangles will be expected based on this, that he said, that it will be po impossible to assume that everything will run peacefully. So wrangles can be there. But how do we ensure stability in political parties? And how do we ensure that who and who is in control of these parties maintaining the same, same stability? Uh, thank you so much, Ram, once again. The most important thing that we must understand about with the political parties, the political parties, they don't run on a vacuum. These are entities that are actually supposed to be geared into uh, stabilizing the country. Now, the more we have the political parties, and um, okay, let me, let me talk of the school of thought, whereby we say that if we have more of the political parties, then that means we have more results of participation. In other words, we strengthen our democracy. Now, uh, that, that's not to say that if you look at it this way, um, we have political parties, who are actually, again, uh, using uh, the political entities to bring their number. This number is being misused during this time in the, in the name of soliciting for more funds. Because if I go for a nomination of any political party, I will be paying that party. But then they don't actually have a cap over the prices for the nomination forms. Now, this is something that is being abused within the system. And... If you talk of uh, uh, the way uh, Rafael Tuju is putting it, it's like uh, they don't want to care about uh, the electorates because the, the, the driving engine here is the electorate. Do, I, do we really capture their interest when we talk of um, I'm, the, I'm the highest bidder? So long as you've given Karl Marx this, uh, the, the nomination certificate for your party, then I run with that in that uh, area that you are dominant, then I become the automatic governor, I become the automatic senator, I become the automatic women, or me, the, the member of county assembly. So we are misusing the powers of the political parties that within the systems, this is the right time that now we have to ask ourselves, do we really uh, tighten or do we really loosen? the rules and uh, the guidelines that are supposed to be governing the registration of the, of the parties so that we don't end up having parties that are negotiating for their own personal aggrandizement and not for the interest of, uh, uh, of the electorate.